Hey guys, it's Linda. Okay, I think we have this one bed ready to plant. And what have I learned from this bed? This is why I want, uh, we wanted to do one bed first before we completed the other one at the same time. Wanted to kind of get a feel for how much dirt we were gonna need. Um, and I can say I didn't put enough topsoil in this one because it just, just keeps taking bag after bag after bag of the um, compost dirt. So um, I'm gonna stop here and I know there's a little lip and I probably will have to be cognizant of the fact on this side there's a little bit of a shade um, it's only like maybe two inches so I'll just not plant that close to the edge um, to so they won't be in the shade but um, I think it'll be fine like it is and then in my second bed I'm gonna put more topsoil where I don't have to use quite as many bags because I have, um, there's well over eight inches of the good compost dirt soil. Um, so I think that's plenty. We're gonna plant some carrot seeds now.
Okay, we've got it all planted and watered. The cabbage said to plant 24 inches apart, so those are pretty wide. Um, and then the, I did go ahead and try some carrot seeds and radishes. We'll see if they come up. But on the carrot seeds, they're so tiny. Um, I'd say to plant those, get them real moist, and then cover with something so those until they germinate. So I'll have to watch those and look under the board and when, when they germinate, remove the board so the sunlight can get to them so they won't die. But I'll show you close up. So, I've uh, said a prayer over them that God helps everything germinate. So we'll watch it and see how it goes. you doing hope you're having a great day today uh, it's been a work day um, but it's finally to an end and it's a beautiful day outside today here in Alabama we uh, Russell ran to the P.O. box today and we got some mail we we're very excited about it so I wanted to share it with you guys we got um, a few stickers thank you guys so much now let me turn you around so you can see them There they are, I already have them on our coop. We're replacing our stickers. And we got uh, one from Yogi Hollow Farm, Jupiter Moon Acres, Hilltop Gardens, uh, Sunshine and Country Farm, and Ormsby Farms. And I had already mentioned Barb's Country Home earlier. So I will link all of those um, below in the description. And if you get a chance, check out their channels. Uh, they have some really great channels and we enjoy watching them. I'll let you see our chickens for just a minute. There they are. <laughs> anyway, I won't keep you. Thanks again for joining us. Y'all have a fantastic day. Love you guys. God bless.